All right, I'm going to do another game here. Um, just so everyone can see different deck styles and whatnot, I'm going to try another new deck. This time we're going to go Greyjoy with Lannister. Looks like we're going up against Targaryen and Lannister. Lannister does seem to be a pretty popular banner faction. I think it has a lot to do with Tyrion. I mean, he's a pretty good card. Alright. Oh, looking at the gold, it looks good. Um, it's not amazing. These cards are amazing, though. Four. Ugh, can't do it. I'm only using up six gold. It isn't bad, but I like to gamble a little bit. And this is significantly worse. <clears throat> yeah, this is awful. I guess I do these three. I was thinking these three, but this does seem a lot better. That is not good, though. Getting Crow's Eye is not terrible, though. Especially if he has anything great here. Hmm, okay. If I can get rid of this, we could be saved pretty good. This guy could, uh, I'm the first player to nail this down, so that's good. I think I'm going to try to get an unopposed challenge, discard this, then get this. So, alright, the question is, what do I lead off plot-wise here? I want to save at least one gold, I want to get her into play. So much gold do I need? So this is... Virtually two gold, because you have to pay one to play it, so two. Um, so two more gold. I want six, seven gold. I really don't want to play Noble Cause first, but I may have to. Because that would give me, because she has a lady, right? So it costs three to play her. And then, yeah. He might as well. If he plays naval, whatever that card is, <clears throat> that'd be annoying. But I haven't seen people playing it yet. I do think it is a decent meta call because most first turn plots are this. Okay, so he gets to pick first player. <clears throat> Interesting. That is interesting. That's very interesting, actually. <laughs> Alright, so we have five gold. Wow. Yeah, that's, this is weird. So if I play Tyrion for two. So I play here. No, this is only by two. All right, so I have to pay three for that. Two, three. So I have two gold. Play this. This. Yeah, that seems like the better play this turn. Um, shoot. No, how would I do this? Because I kind of want to play this. Um, I guess I could do an intrigue and then gain a gold that way. So. Alright, so play. Oh, whoops. Oh, what am I doing here? Wow, wake up, Brandon. It is 11 o'clock and I just got off work, so <laughs> bear with me here. So that's reduced by 4. So we spent 1 gold. For Tyrion. And then I could do. 
one gold for this guy. I reduce by two to play her. It's a pretty good first turn. Yeah, I feel like we do that. One, two. Alright. I mean, three big characters out on the first turn. It's not a bad thing. Alright, so I also will get gold from Tyrion. Hmm, I haven't seen this art yet. I haven't built a Targaryen deck. That's actually the only house I haven't used. And I haven't faced any yet, so I kind of like this art. Oh. Alright, so. <laughs> new plan! <laughs> we are going to have to uh, put the sword... Good old Varius. <laughs> I'm interested with this though. He didn't march. Well. I wonder if uh, a moneylander was the guy who was gonna play. <laughs> so I have to win by five. Or I could stealth past him. That's not a problem. All right. So we have to do intrigue first. <clears throat> Alright, so we get two gold. Can't play a We Do Not Sow even if he lets it go on a pose. Because getting this right now is <clears throat> not as important as killing bears. You do have to make sure we're by five. Okay, so he's going to defend it. to go crazy here because <clears throat> if he defends yeah so is he ever done? yeah that's huge Get a Keen's Road here. Oh, that's okay too. Uh, what if? Oh, because of. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, that was a pretty good turn. He's going to hit one of these cards, but. Nah, who cares? This is a power challenge, right? <clears throat> Minus two and kill, so that would kill just my gold guys. Alright, that's fine. So that was a pretty big swing. Direct kill is pretty huge. And getting Tyrion in play really helped me. Uh, I may not want to be able to afford it otherwise, so. He may play Wildfire here, but he's only really hitting two little guys. I think because he didn't play any cards, we are just going to play this this turn. And hope to hit something good. Alright, so he's playing Wildfire. 
So he's just going to get two little chuds out of it. So I still have like a cold or allergy or something, so... sucks. Again, I've shared my opinion. It's the plots in the game. I don't think they're going to do anything to it soon, but it is what it is. So, that's not exactly what I want to see. <laughs> oh, whoops. Yeah. This wasn't really a choice. I have four gold. Do you spend one? I'll play this guy out. And then, might as well play this because I can. So, we're going to, we not just, we do not sow the Plaza of Punishment. And I'm going to trigger you on to uh, put in a play. So that's pretty good. This card is amazing. It's like really the reason to uh, play Greyjoy. So now here's what I gotta think. Um, do I need? To kneel down this card. Because he's at four gold, so you could play a Tyrion if you wanted to. Or a Jamie. I don't really want to deal with any of that, so. <laughs> We're going to shut down his economy. Yeah, I'm on board. I have the better board presence. So. This guy just being able to hit this is huge, and also if he does end up triggering it, I will have economy for days. I think it's safe to say next turn I'm going to play my counting coppers. Interesting. Well, this game may be overdone. This is kind of when where the game needs Valar, <laughs> but it's going to be it's going to be a different game if that plot comes back because uh, you need a. Uh, You need better card draw because no one wants to get into a mode where you have this in your hand, board gets wiped. I mean, it, that's not that's not fun. So we're gonna discard his plaza. Yeah, this is going to be a quick one. Could ambush something, though, so. So, you're going to amb if you just ambush <laughs> ambushes two characters. I think we're going to swing with the, whoops. Yeah. I mean, that was huge. That was his reset, and I killed him right away. And then I was going to get his plaza back, and Cunning Coppers next turn. That was going to be my hand next turn. A dupe, my source of draw, a milk. Yeah. Alright, so I guess I'm going to just keep recording here. Um, question is, do I run the same deck or a different one? 
Dark, Tyrell with Night's Watch. I could play that one. I'll ask him if he wants to um, me to play the same deck, I will. Alright, we'll just use the same deck. Um, sure. That wasn't really a game, so we'll try it. Also, I want to... Whoops. Whoops. I'm going to see how bad this is. Alright, what am I running here? Da, 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 that's all fine. Only one of them. I'm playing this guy? Ooh. Um, um, whatever. We'll try it. Whatever. <laughs> um, this is looking pretty good. Five, six. Oh, it's nine. Oh, oh, so close. I think I just don't play this then. Four cards. I get a gold. Seems fine. Pretty good hand. Got Tyrion play right away. I got my claim soak. Ooh, it's Plaza will hit this guy though. That's not great. <clears throat> All right. Am I still running Noble Claws on this one? I am not. That could be a problem. I may just start off with heads. I'd have four, five, six gold virtually. I could play Asha with um, Little Bird. Not bad. We'll do it. I also have plus one gold from Littlefinger. I'll just go with heads. Alright, so he'll pick. We'll see if he picks me again. A little interesting with the uh, Greyjoy, especially with uh, having these guys out. That's virtually I'm gonna have plus four strength this turn. Oh jeez. Whoops. Oh. Oh yeah. Okay. So I hit Trickery. Yeah, he didn't do it. Alright, so I got five gold. Ooh, playing this seems tempting. Alright, well, we're gonna play my one limited card, because you can only play one of them. Okay, so that gives a character deadly virtually. Um. Trigger this, so that's three, four, 
four, five. We'll play Asha. Hmm. Can't even pull, trigger put to the torch yet, so we'll play Little Bird. I may milk Tyrion or put a throw axe at Asha. I want to milk Tyrion. See, like, this is the thing with Heads of Pike. This time I got a treachery. Which is good, but. Actually, that's. Could be really good. Considering it can cancel either a stand. Oh, uh, oh, okay, taxation. Yeah. Oh my. We're gonna get to see the good old queen? No. Pay two gold to choose the same character. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Hmm. Got a lot of blockers. I think we're just gonna send an intrigue in here. He, he does. He could play a treachery, but I still think I'm gonna do it. I am playing three aiming though. Um, this isn't the greatest deck. I I know it isn't. Um, that's why last time. When I wanted to play Greyjoy, I used the Lannister one. This is just... Aemon and uh, um, Ghost are really good. Ghost being able to practically just lock down anyone. Oh man, he really wanted to win that one. So he definitely has something. That he wants to spend this gold on. I'm guessing it's a treachery. We started a new game. <laughs> it's like, what happened to his power? <laughs> Alright, so I have to do a power first. He doesn't have the two gold. I'm, <clears throat> I'm assuming he's going to have a treachery, but if he uses it on this, that's fine. Oh, God. Oh, nope. Alright. Um, I can't do a military though with her standing. They have four strength, so I might as well do my military. Make him nail down his intrigue icon if he wants to block, so. I guess if he doesn't block, I could block his intrigue anyway, so. Yeah, that makes sense. I just didn't want him to trigger his ability. <laughs> so he should do a power here probably, unless he has a treachery. Which would really suck. Oh, nope, so he's going with the power, so that's good. And that's fine, because now I'll win Dom, so. Alright, this one's looking to be like a game, so that's good.
Wildfire. We just killed the tickler. Neil. He has two. Pays two gold to stay in the guy. He only has three cards in hand. I think I'm just gonna go with heads again. It's whatever. So probably the milk is gonna be gone. The question is, do I want to go first? Hmm. I think I may actually want him to go first right now. It'll make my unopposed challenges probably easier. Um So I did get a character, so I get power. And I'm assuming he's gonna hit milk of the poppy. Yep. Cause these two work really well together. I shouldn't have let him go first, that was dumb. I'm not going to take it back, so it's fine. Alright, now we're good, because now if he has a treachery, because now I'm just going to trigger his ability to save this game, at least while he's in play, so that is nice to have. Is this Danny? Mm. Alright, if he top decked that, that's fine, but if I could have heads on that, that would have sucked. <laughs> Alright, well, let's just stand. Each character participant on port aside gets minus one. <coughs> Alright, so I got. Four or five gold. Nothing looks good. Kind of want to play this, but I don't even have enough military strength. Ugh. Right, we're gonna throw this guy out there. I'm gonna throw this out there. Kill those two, and you'd have those three left. Hmm. Um. What's my reserve six? I'm gonna change. Sacrifice. Choose and kill a different character. I think I want to do that. Oh shoot! This only. This is the Night's Watch one. All right. So. Because of that, I guess I'll play a throwing axe. That was a mistake on my part. So I'm not sure I'm going to pay for the crow's eye. <laughs> yeah, it's annoying. Good combination. This is actually exactly what I was thinking of. What? Oh, okay. Hmm. So I could defend for one. Ah, uh, yeah. With how he's looking, I want to stop as much as I can. That's fine, I probably wasn't going to pay for him ever, so. <laughs> yep, he gets to draw a card. Then he'll just pay two gold to stand here, la dee da dee da Hmm, this is going to be really annoying. 
with that that you have to trigger, like for those of you that didn't play first edition, normally you had to do all your triggers before you declared stealth. Now you have to do them, you have to declare stealth first, which makes it a lot harder. But probably a good thing because right now, with it being so challenge focused, um, she has two military icons and a bunch of other icons. So, hmm. this is actually really annoying. All right, so if I do an intrigue, stealthing him. I could use throwing axe to kill someone, but you have to wait, don't you? Hmm. So, shoot, I made him first. This is. I do power stealthing him first. Power Southern Ham, you'd have to defend with one of these guys. If you defend with both, that's 8 strength. Alright, I think we're going to do this. Stealthing Ham. We're going to name a power challenge, because I could maybe bait out... So it's either going to be unopposed or I get to throw an X someone, I, I believe. I didn't exactly do the math. 4, 8, 9, 10, minus 2, so that's 8, yeah. Unless you stay and then defend with all of them, but... <laughs> yep, so we're going to spend 2 gold. Stay in Danny. Yep. So four, eight, thirteen versus four, eight, nine, ten. Alright, I do still think that was the best line. Because now I at least can get... Oh, shnikes. Yeah. Totally forgot inside it worked that way. I thought it was like a limited trigger. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope dumb. Castilian gives him gold, then he stands, blah, 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 blah. That was, I was assuming I'd be able to kill someone, so. One, two. Alright. His dom. Alrighty. This is going to be, get annoying here. Oh. Yeah, da 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 Alright. That's fine. Alright, so I could get rid of her stealth, which would be good, and I just get rid of blockers, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to wildfire here. Counting coppers was a close second, but I just need to get this board more manageable. They do have that stupid attachment, though, I could just bring this guy back, but not an attachment event. Really need to draw milk here.
I'm not even sure. I guess cow would suck right now. Yep, alright. <laughs> At least that's his only military icon. Four, five, six, and it would cost most of his gold. I gotta find a way to trigger this. Some economy here. Oh, my, when did he have so many cards? Six. Oh, my goodness. All right, this is going to be tough. Uphill battle from here, good boys. Alright, so. Yeah, playing him doesn't do me too much right now. Uh, plus two, plus two. So I guess. Alright, that's smart. So now I'm definitely not gonna do it, I don't think. So if I nail that one. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna play this guy and call it good. And then four, five, six, seven, eight. Try to trigger put to the torch. Er, sword. Three and only hope. He's got He's got his combo here going. The problem is I don't even know what I'm gonna put to the torch. Is it Danny or is it one of these guys? Probably whichever one doesn't get it duped. Four, five, six. So that's Cal Drogo. Oh, okay. So three. Oh, he set his gold to four. Okay. Yep. 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 Okay. So I'm not picking Cal Drogo. <laughs> oh, so frustrating. Alright, so I'm pretty sure we killed Tyrion. So he's four, three, We'll give it plus two strength. <laughs> Kill Tyrion. That is just annoying. <laughs> Alright, so that actually worked. So that's good. Let's draw some cards. Got rid of a bodyguard. That's good. Alright, if I do an Intrigue, Stealthing this guy, I have to kneel down Danny, and I can still win it, so let's do that. Alright, this actually is looking better. He's down to five cards. Well, not twice per round. Oh, he's going to defend, huh? Um, four, ooh, the hand's judgment, that would have been, that could be good. 
Alright, so I'm assuming he's got the event to bring it back eventually, but... Alright, what do I have left? The power challenge? It's not worth doing. So... Done. Alright, that was pretty good. I cannot complain about that turn. I killed a Danny and I killed a uh, Tyrion. I think I need more put to the torch swords in most decks. Oh, he also doesn't have a Lannister anymore either, so. Alright, these guys uh, did their work today, so. So he does a so he does a power challenge. That makes sense. So I should at least defend it. Should be by Dom, I believe. Let's make do a quick check. All right, still recording. That's good. I don't know. It's a challenge action, right? Yeah, because the other, because uh, or maybe it's not. I'm not sure. I'm talking about the bring a character back. Alright, so, what do I even have for options here? He may wildfire here, I lose this guy, that's fine. I'm probably going to kneel down Kaldrogo. Seems like a decent, decent play. <laughs> Interesting. So I gotta pick first player. I want to go first. And we'll nail Cal, Cal Drogo. Oh dear, what in the world is happening here? I didn't mean to hit the internet. Alright. Oh, we got a dupe Basha, that's nice. So five gold. Littlefinger's doing some work since I'm not getting my economy at all. Yeah, use them all, that's fine. I'm not going to waste them on that. Three, four, five. <clears throat> Question is, do I need anything else out there? Um, maybe I should put this guy out instead. Doesn't have any attachments out there though yet, so it's hard to justify it. Um, I think I'm just gonna hold this back. I'm also threatening a put to the sword again that he may respect. So if he wants to stay in Keldrogo, he's only going to have one gold to spend this turn. <clears throat> uh, Sir Jora. He is pretty good. He is pretty good. Spend two gold, please. No, two gold. Ooh. So, military, no, whoops, 
No, I don't, what were they doing here? No, I got a military stop this guy. Yes. If you want to spend two gold, go for it. So I should have definitely played the claim soak. I have one save, two saves. All right. Draw a card. Get rid of a dupe. Okay, so that's fine. So, um, power. I mean, I definitely know what his line is. It's he's gonna go crazy with this guy. So, but if he lets Ash Asha stand, uh. Yeah, I was like, uh, don't think you can defend the power challenge. Let's draw another card. Because I'm pretty sure I'm just going to want to defend the military challenge. Or at least one of them. Um, <laughs> and I might as well just do an intrigue with this guy. Well, no, that doesn't do me anything, does it? Guess it doesn't hurt me. Yeah, let's do it. Guess killing Benji won't be the worst thing either. I'd go up to 9 power. Because right now I can defend for 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 4, 9, 10, 11. So I can win at least one of these challenges, so. Oh, interesting. Something good. Yeah, that's something good. Alright, so this is actually, uh. It's becoming a game. Yep, so he's gonna stand Cal. <coughs> Saw that coming. Oh, so never mind. He'll send both. So he'll send both at the first challenge. Five, nine, ten, eleven, four, five, six. Well, if he sends just cow, I can block both of them, so. For five, seven strength. Oh, thank gosh, this was participating. <laughs> Got a little nervous for a second, so. Four, six, eight. Wow, Asha is proving to be a superstar this game. Cause now I'll just kill the dupe. I guess that's all he has to send now. Uh, do we even bother defending this one? I could win the power challenge. Um, yeah, I'm gonna kneel. Well, I, I mean, I don't even have to kneel, Amen. I could just discard the dupe in this guy. Hmm. All right. So there is interesting options here. Because Illyrio will do an intrigue. I can defend it. The question is, like, none of these are really that relevant. I am gonna want to get this guy out to now discard this. But I have two of them, so. Is it five power? Six, seven? I think I just want to defend all the challenges this turn. <laughs> so 
So we'll trigger him here. The question is, do I want to get rid of the dupe? It's not actually that easy to say. I think right now we do just because um, <laughs> there's nothing. Uh, actually, no, I don't want to do that. I'm just going to discard this, kill this guy, because uh, I think Wildfire seems like a reasonable option for him at this point. I would have had five characters to his three anyways, so... Intrigue... And power. I can only defend one of them anyway, so... Oh, that's fine. I really only needed the one, so... Two claim. Well, that's not good. I wanted one of those guys still. Oh, it's two claim power. Ugh. Ugh. That actually hurts. Now he's up to four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten power. Wowza. Or nine, I can do math. Well, he does have ten. I don't know why it's counting it wrong, but I'm at seven somehow. Nine if you count this guy dying, so this is a good game. Alright, so I could confiscate this, but I don't think so since I'm going to put one of those guys into play. I think we're just going to play this in case he plays his two clone plot again. Um. Yeah, that's that's fair. <laughs> Although, shoot, I don't... Okay, so that is what he did. Okay, good. So... I think I just killed Benji. I'm going to have six gold, four, five, six, and whatever I draw. So, I'm going to name military because he's going to do two military challenges. <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to kill this guy. And I'm going to shuffle him into my deck. Alright, well, I was just making sure that in 2.0 it is still k not be saved. I assumed it was. Oh. Ghost! Good old ghost! So, things are going to get interesting here. We may start doing the, I just want power <laughs> effect. So I'm curious, he's got five cards, four, five, six, seven gold virtually. Oodles of gold now. I'm sure I have five, six. Shoot, because I really want to get this guy to play. <clears throat> Stupid throat. A Jamie would not be cool. I said a Jamie wouldn't be cool. Uh, don't care about that except for being a blocker. Alright, so. Six gold. Humbug. I really wanted to get this guy to play. But I guess with me going tr um, second, it's not as big of a deal either. So I think I'm going to just play Ghost and a Chud.
So he gets a free military challenge, really, so... Yeah, we'll give him double renown. Ugh. Ugh. I mean, I can't win it, can I? Well, he gets to do it... Oh my gosh, he gets to do it twice. I think that's gonna be game. Cause that's gonna be... 12... Or 10, 11, 12, 13... Shoot. Hmm. Alright, so let's see if I defend. If I defend. He gets. It goes from 10, 11, 12. I defend, 30, 14. Yeah, I think he got it. It was a really close game, though. I think if I would have gone first, I could have gotten it. I mean, it wasn't real close, but like if I would have gone first, I would have stealth passed something here, so that I would have gotten probably my two on opposed challenges. So that's 11, 12, 13. Or 11, 12, 13, a power challenge is 14, so. <laughs> um, I've seen this guy in the forums, so I'm just letting him know that I recorded him. Uh, I think it was interesting. Alright, I'm pretty sure I showed you guys my deck at the beginning of the game. Uh, getting one of these would have been nice. Uh, doesn't... kind of want to look at the economy a little bit, just because it never felt like I could play enough of these big guys. And I didn't draw in my economy, which didn't help, but... Um, and a Theon out there also would have been nice. Get a little more power. But, alright, hope you guys enjoy these games, and you'll see more for sure pretty soon. Been really hooked on this game, glad it's come out. So, alright, take care guys.